Stepping on toes, navigating the nuances of English idioms. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into the colorful world of English idioms. Our focus is on the phrase, step on some toes. Have you ever wondered what it means to step on someone's toes in a conversation or at work? Well, you're in the right place to find out. The phrase, step on some toes, doesn't involve literal feet or toes. It's an idiom meaning to offend or irritate someone, usually by overstepping boundaries or authority. It's often used in social and professional contexts. For example, if you make a decision at work without consulting your team, you might step on some toes. Let's see how this idiom works in different scenarios. 1. In the workplace, imagine you're a manager and you implement a new policy without discussing it with your team. Your actions might step on some toes because your team feels overlooked or disrespected. 2. In personal relationships, if you're at a family dinner and you criticize a relative's cooking, you might step on their toes. It implies that you've hurt their feelings, perhaps unintentionally. 3. In public situations, if someone cuts in line at the grocery store, they are stepping on the toes of others waiting. It shows a lack of respect for the social rules. Understanding synonyms can deepen your grasp of the idiom. Here are a few. Rub someone the wrong way. This means to irritate or annoy someone. Overstep one's bounds. This implies going beyond what is acceptable or respectful in a situation. Tread on dangerous ground. This suggests taking risks that might offend or cause trouble. To avoid stepping on someone's toes, it's important to be aware of cultural norms and personal boundaries. Communication and respect are key. Always consider how your actions or words might be perceived by others. Today, we explored the idiom, step on some toes, and its place in English communication. Remember, idioms add color and depth to our language, but they require careful use to avoid misunderstandings. We hope this video helps you navigate your English conversations with confidence and respect. Keep learning, and see you in the next video.